Hi Capricorn, this is a peek at your partner for the week of June the 5th through June the 11th, 2022. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Capricorn for June the 5th through June the 11th, 2022. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Capricorn for June the 5th through June the 11th, 2022. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Capricorn for June the 5th through June the 11th, 2022. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Capricorn. Capricorn, this is a peek at your partner. So, Capricorn, your partner has the Emperor. Your partner has the Eight of Pentacles. Your partner has the Empress. Your partner has the Ace of Wands. And your partner has the King of Wands. So, Capricorn, your partner has the Emperor. Could be dealing with an Aries or a Taurus, but the Emperor is someone who runs empires. This is a boss, a business owner, CEO, independent contractor, manager. This is usually an older gentleman. It doesn't have to be, but someone who's wise yet stern, someone who wants complete control and authority. So Capricorn could be dealing with an Aries or a Taurus. Could be dealing with a spouse because the emperor is a married, stable, committed person. Could be dealing with the parent of your child because the emperor is a father figure. Could also be dealing with someone you work with or do business with. This can also be someone that your partner works with or does business with. Clarify the emperor for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the emperor for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the emperor for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with the Knight of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is someone rushing into your partner or your partner rushing in to start a passionate, creative new endeavor. And someone could be rushing in, going off, going ham passionately, rushing in with the spark of a new idea, rushing in with some type of exciting, passionate communication, exciting, passionate action. But this one is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. This is flighty energy, in and out energy, player energy. So Capricorn, listen, there could be a rush to do something here. Could be a rushing in, going off, going hand passionately with a heated discussion or argument. Or someone was out being a player getting cookies somewhere. Clarify the Knight of Wands for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the Knight of Wands for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the Knight of Wands for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with strength. Could be dealing with a Leo, but the universe is calling for your partner to have strength, courage, determination, motivation, to keep moving forward and to do the right thing. But this is also a card of your partner trying to tame their lusts, tame their passions, trying to restrain themselves, restrict themselves, and hold themselves back from something. So listen, Capricorn could be dealing with a Leo, but your partner could tell me that they're feeling extremely weak here. Your partner could tell me that they're restraining themselves, restricting themselves, and holding themselves back, or trying to muster the strength and courage to do something. Clarify strength for Capricorn's partner. Clarify strength for Capricorn's partner. Clarify strength for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with the magician. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, but your partner's trying to manifest, trying to make something happen. And they have all the tools and resources available to them to manifest whatsoever they will. They have the earth element, the water element, the air element, the fire element, and the ethers. So with great focus and intent, they can manifest. So Capricorn could be dealing with an Aquarius, but your partner's trying to make something happen here. Clarify the magician for Capricorns. Well, <laughs> clarify the magician for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the magician 
for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the magician for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with justice. Could be dealing with a Libra, but your partner may be calling for karmic justice, saying, you know what? I'm a good person. I put good out there. I'm just expecting that good to return to me. Or your partner saying someone did me so wrong and so dirty, I'm calling for karmic justice. I want them to get exactly what they deserve. Or your partner's dealing with something in the justice system. So Capricorn could be dealing with a Libra, but your partner could tell me that, hey, something isn't fair, something isn't balanced, something isn't just. Your partner could tell me that someone is coming in to right a wrong to bring justice to a situation. Or they're dealing with something in the justice system. Clarify justice for Capricorn's partner. Clarify justice for Capricorn's partner. Clarify justice for Capricorn's partner. Ace of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is truth. This is clarity. This is communication. Now, this could be the sword of decision, the sword of victory. But this could also be the sword that one reels to sever a relationship. So listen, Capricorn, your partner could tell me that you guys are having this communication or some type of communication is taking place. Your partner could tell me that they've come into some truth and clarity here. Your partner could tell me that they're making a decision or using a sword to sever. So listen, I feel like there's some type of conversation happening here. Very well could be a heated discussion or argument because your partner is saying that something wasn't fair, something wasn't balanced, something wasn't just, and someone could be threatening to go to the justice system here, okay? Could be because someone was out being a player, getting cookies somewhere in you guys' relationship, but it could also be some type of heated discussion or argument taking place with work or business here. We'll see. Listen, Capricorn, your partner has the Eight of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is mastering their craft, perfecting their skills, trades, and abilities. This is your partner throwing themselves into their work. But this can also speak to your partner being willing to work on it or put in the work. So listen, Capricorn, your partner may be telling me that, hey, you know, something is going on with work or business. Or your partner's telling me that they're wanting to work things out, willing to work on this, or they're working on something. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles for Capricorn's partner. Mm, the lovers could be dealing with a Gemini, but the lover says, you know, I breathe you in, you breathe me in. We are so magnetically attracted to one another. We cannot get enough of one another. Babe, I need to make a choice. So listen, Capricorn could be dealing with a Gemini, but yes, your partner could tell me that you guys have this strong twin flame magnetic pull. Mm -hmm. Your partner could tell me that there was another other lover, but the lovers is also a partnership with work or business. Clarify the lovers for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the lovers for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the lovers for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with the star. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, but the star symbolizes having hope, having faith, healing, getting their wish, being divinely guided, following their destiny. So listen, Capricorn could be dealing with an Aquarius, but your partner could tell me that they're getting their wish, following their destiny. Your partner could tell me that they need to heal individually on their own, or they're holding out hope and faith that you guys can heal things, mend things, work things out and reconcile. Clarify the star. For Capricorn's partner, clarify the star for Capricorn's partner, clarify the star for Capricorn's partner. Eight of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve them. This is your partner detaching emotionally, feeling emotionally drained, and just walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve them. So Capricorn, listen, your partner could tell me that they're walking away, detaching emotionally. Now this could be work or business, or it could be you guys' relationship because they need to heal individually on their own because they feel like maybe you had another other lover out being a player here however when we're dealing with the eight of cups this is someone who's leaving in search of their nine of cups their wish fulfillment and oftentimes they find that the grass is not greener on the other side so they end up returning so your partner may want to return and work things out here okay we'll see capricorn your partner has the empress could be dealing with a libra or a taurus 
But the empress signifies beauty, fertility, creativity, nurturing energy, love, abundance, growth, and development. This is a pregnant woman. She is symbolic of the Mother Earth. She takes the seed of something and nurtures it so that it grows abundantly. So listen, Capricorn could be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus. Could be dealing with a spouse because the Empress is a married, stable, committed person. Could be dealing with the parent of your child or someone who's expecting. Now this can be about your partner's abundance, but it could also be about nurturing the relationship. Clarify the Empress for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the Empress for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the Empress for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with the really the King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This king is a very intelligent, analytical, and logical king. He only wants to deal with the truth, the facts, and the proof of the matter. So this is about truthful communication, and this is about making a decision. So Capricorn could be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or someone with air prominent in their charts. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this King of Swords, coming forth with truthful communication or making a decision. Clarify the King of Swords for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the King of Swords for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the King of Swords for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with you, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, the King of Pentacles. This king is usually stable, rooted, grounded, traditional, believes in the institution of marriage and family, someone who is good with managing finances and material resources. This could be a business owner, CEO, independent contractor, manager. So Capricorn, this is you, but it could also be work or business here. Clarify the King of Pentacles. For Capricorn's partner. Clarify the King of Pentacles for Capricorn's partner. What does Capricorn's partner think of Capricorn? What does Capricorn's partner think of Capricorn? Clarify the King of Pentacles for Capricorn's partner. <clears throat> Ace of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is a brand new beginning in love, a brand new beginning in a deep emotional connection. This is love overflowing, a brand new blessing, a brand new beginning in love. So Capricorn, listen, new love, new start to love or blessing. Now Capricorn, listen, I asked what does your partner think of you? Your partner may think that you have new love. You had another other lover here. You were out being a player. Your partner may think that they want to nurture the relationship with you and start new here, maybe returning to work things out here, needing to make a decision concerning it. However, listen, this could be a new blessing with work or business for your partner concerning their abundance and they're needing to make a decision here, okay? Maybe to leave one employer and maybe have a blessing with a new employer lined up here. So Capricorn, your partner has the Ace of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is a brand new, passionate, creative endeavor. Now this can be the spark of a new idea. This can be some type of exciting, passionate communication, exciting, passionate action. But this wand is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. So brand new, passionate beginnings. So Capricorn, listen, your partner could tell me that they have the spark of a new idea. They may be initiating something here. This can be passionate communication, romantic passion, or a heated discussion or argument, or someone starting a passionate new beginning. Clarify the Ace of Wands for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the Ace of Wands for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the Ace of Wands for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with the Nine of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner being anxious, worried, stressed, replaying things over and over in their mind, losing sleep at night, worried about something. So your partner is stressed, worried, all up in their head, bothered on whether or not they're going to initiate something here, you know, maybe walk away, okay, from maybe an employer here, or your partner's all up in the head concerning maybe some type of argument that took place here, or they're worried about the fact that they think that you started a passionate new beginning. Capricorn, your partner has the King of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This king is a very charming, charismatic character, someone who's admired by many. This is a leader, a go getter, a take charge type of energy, someone who sets out on many objectives and usually accomplishes them with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their charts. 
However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands is someone who initiates, who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or your partner is wanting to take action. Clarify the King of Wands for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the King of Wands for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the King of Wands for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with the King of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This king is a very loving, kind, compassionate king. He's fair and balanced in his emotions, but he does not wear his emotions on his sleeve. He's in complete control of his emotions. So Capricorn could be dealing with Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces, or someone with water prominent in their charts. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this King of Cups. Now, the King of Cups is someone with a great deal of emotions within them, but they're not outwardly expressing their emotions. They're masking their emotions or wearing a mask. Also with the King of Cups, this is a nurturing father figure, so you could be dealing with the parent of your child here. Clarify the King of Cups for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the King of Cups for Capricorn's partner. Clarify the King of Cups for Capricorn's partner. It is clarified with this Ace of Wands again. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is a brand new, passionate, creative endeavor. Now, this can be the spark of a new idea. This can be some type of exciting, passionate communication, exciting, passionate action. But this one is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. So, brand new, passionate beginnings. So, listen, Capricorn, your partner's either telling me that <clears throat> they're taking action here. Okay, they feel some type of way and maybe some type of heated discussion or argument is taking place. Okay, it just feels like they have to get something off of their chest and they're, they're not going to be able to rest until they do. This can be work or business or with you. However, your partner could also tell me that, you know, they're all up in their head stressing because they feel like you started a passionate new beginning somewhere. And for some of you guys, a baby may be involved here because we have this empress here and the ace of cups is brand new blessing could be a baby. So your partner's all up in the head about having to make some type of decision here. Capricorn, this is a peek at your partner for the week of June the 5th through June the 11th, 2022. You guys give me feedback, subscribe, like, comment, and share, and I'll see you guys next week. Peace.